three months earlier and the lifeguards undergo their annual trials. Existing lifeguards must prove they're still up to the job, while newcomers have a chance to prove they have what it takes to join the team. Straight up and down. This season, the youngest applicant ever. At 16, Trent Maxwell has one driving ambition. I'm a family, like right in the fires or the ambos. Since I love the beach so much, there's a rescue field in like, lifeguard service. And uh, yeah, I like to find myself to that position. So yeah, that's why I want to be a lifeguard. I want to save people, have fun, boys go surfing. We're here because we're his parents. We, um... We're supportive all the way, we're 100% behind him, and while he's still only 16 and we can be here, we're going to be here, so. Yeah, first two going, so start of a new season, see how we go. Applicants must first complete an 800 metre swim in under 13 and a half minutes. Not everyone will make it. There's 15 new guys trying out, and you've got another 25, 30 guys coming back from last season, so there's not many spots that are vacant. <laughs> but anyway, it's done for another year. I'm stoked. 13-15, still can't get rid of you, Bob. Popo's going to have to wait another year to get rid of me. He's been trying for years. You'll put it down to 13 next year and I'll make that too. Blake was the rookie who proved himself last season. Now, he wants to be a fully-fledged lifeguard. Everyone here has kind of earned their spot on their team and proven why they're here, so it's up to the new kids to prove why, why they're needed and why, why they've earned their spot. Blake comes in with a minute and a half to spare. Young Trent Maxwell, or Maxie, bolts in with one of the fastest times on the day. 10.37 or something, so that's all right. The old crew all make the grey. Best time ever. For other contenders, the day and the dream is over. Okay, the first group. Everyone here on the first group. Go! At Bondi, the trial continues with an Ironman race, a punishing run, swim, and board paddle. The old guard compete in the first heat. Oh, yeah. Fine. Meanwhile, Kerbox takes Maxi under his wing. Hey, don't go too hard, just take it easy and I mean, know what you can do. Just make sure you just got enough in the tank for the end of it. It's a long, long race. Maxi and Blake go head to head in the second Ironman trial. Maxi comes in second, well ahead of Blake. Well done. Nice start. Blake puts in a respectable performance. I expected uh, Blake to do good, and he did good. He's come a long way from last year, mate, and uh, it showed then he went really well. I'll kill it. Oh, my arms are killing me. <laughs> the tension's over for now, but Blake and Max will soon find out whether they have a future as professional lifeguards. They face an anxious wait. We've got both of them now. Oh, I'm so nervous. Hello, Hop, mate. Un unfortunately, um, there wasn't really a position there we could put you in, so uh, you missed out in, in that um, area. Uh, but considering your uh, performance and the, the talent you sort of showed, we think there's a, a future there as being a lifeguard. So what we've done is we've put you on a um, uh, trainee program. Sick. Then you'll learn the ropes through the, sh uh, the next season or so. so when, yeah. So, uh, you happy with that? Yeah, I'm stoked. Thanks, mate. All right, mate. See you, mate. See, see, see you, mate. Bye. Bye. Stoked. And it's hectic that I'm working on Bondi Beach. And uh, it's just, it's just screw us. <laughs> Blake was a fish out of water last season, but the boy who lives miles from the beach proved he could handle life and death situations. And some silly ones too. You're not wearing appropriate swimwear, you must leave the beach. Yeah, that's right, put them on. All right, all right. Okay. That doesn't mean he's earned a permanent position. The applied for all the positions to become a lifeguard. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, that you're, you're unsuccessful in that in, in that part, being a seasonal or a, or a casual lifeguard. Yeah. But what we've put together is a similar to last year with your trainee program. You'll be doing four days on the beach 
yeah. uh, down here with us. Obviously, I would have preferred to be one of the full-on lifeguard positions, but clearly you're the boss, you know what's best. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, nah, yeah, definitely the full-time thing will make a big difference. Seriously, if I can't get it by then, then I shouldn't be doing it. <laughs> oh, mate, summer is going to be unreal. Full time at the beach. I can't wait for it. Like, yeah, pretty much living on the beach. It's going to be sick. Can't wait.